wanted to show you what I do when I traveled. I love creating a space that I spend most of my time in, sleeping and whatever. I want it to feel like home. I want it to be bright and cheery and healthy for me. So yeah, I'm just going to show you what I've done. I wasn't planning on doing a video on this, but this is just what I do and I thought why not share what I've already done <laughs> and what I do every time I leave home. So I'm going to start with this area behind me. I have, so what I did was when I got into Arizona or into Scottsdale, I looked to see what my villa looked like to see what I I'm working with do I have a kitchen do I not have a kitchen how big is the fridge and my parents uh, drove their RV so I did pack um, a cutting board and a knife and I put it in their RV just so I knew that I had that if the villa didn't so I'm gonna bring you to each of my little sections and we will end with a fridge tour of what I bought. I went to Trader Joe's. It was close by. So um, I just went there and filled up my fridge for the week. Over here I bought lemons and limes for water. Mostly lemon water. I think I'm going to squeeze quite a few and make lemonade. Um, but it's so good. I probably will make some daiquiris later being they had a blender here. And I turned on the ice maker as soon as I opened up the freezer. It takes a long time to make some ice, but they do have an ice machine here. Um, so I travel with vitamin D3 and vitamin C. So I take those every day, just, you know, traveling. And my cutting board and knife that I had with in my, in my parents' RV. But I make my powders I have a chocolate shake that I make and I use this for that so I brought that as well but I got some avocados pineapple and I got some dried mango here and then I have a little trail mix I can grab just a little I put them in little cups around the place to snack on so that's that area and if you can see can see I have made so when I come to every place I actually brought put vases I have little traveling vases and I put them in my parents RV as well because I knew that I wanted flowers for sure I would have taken them with me in my luggage but they were driving so why not so I bought four bouquets of flowers at Trader Joe's and I just I put one together there we go, with some coconut chocolate pieces. And I also put just a little bit like in a wine glass for the dining table. I just had two vases and I wanted a third one for the table. And then I did another flower arrangement right there um, okay so the next area is the coffee place I brought my own teas with a traveling mug I bought some coffee and my chocolate shake that I will be having and I usually just mix that with almond milk or any kind of non-dairy milk but if I'm craving coffee, I have some. And can't forget some red wine. Let's see. Okay, so I think I got everything now. So now it's my fridge. We can start with the freezer. And all I have in here is a little like pizza more of like an appetizer and then leftover pizza from last night we went to um, 
some kind of pizza place in Scottsdale. It was so good. So I just froze the pizza and I can throw it in the oven anytime I want it or give it to my parents. They can eat it in their RV, whatever they want. But I bought some frozen fruit. I got wild blueberries, mangoes, and a blend of berries. I am in love with Trader Joe's. The prices are crazy. Back home, I would have paid twice as much for everything. Um, insane. I was so happy. <laughs> and okay, so this is gonna be my fridge. Let's see. Okay, so. I have unsweetened almond milk coffee creamer and I got a Caesar dressing because I wanted to eat a lot of salads. I got some cheese and uh, like another cheese thing that you can put on crackers. Water I got and then inside I have I have a green juice, ginger shot, which I've already taken one. Every morning I would like to take one, but um, I'll probably end up going back and getting more. So I have a ginger shot, three yogurts, um, cashew yogurt, so that's pretty cool. Um, cashew yogurt's probably one of my favorites, yeah. And it's vanilla flavored, which is also one of my favorites. I also got raspberries for the yogurt, and for cheese and crackers, I also got grapes. I have salsa, so I can make a guac with my avocados. Feta cheese, you need that for salads, green onions. I have arugula, an herb blend, and cabbage for all my greens. Peas that I'm going to lightly steam so they're still crunchy and then I have organic microgreens I wonder if they say okay so it's broccoli kohlrabi mizuna uh, kale red cabbage red mustard amaranth and tatsoe hmm. I don't know a couple of those but yeah I'm really excited for a salad I have uh, smoked salmon for crackers and cheese later uh, Turkey breast slices for my salad or for my cheese and crackers Cucumber red onion and cilantro That is what I'm eating this week and My mom is making some meals. We're gonna barbecue tonight and um yeah, play it by ear. I just like to surround myself with the good food. That way if I do go out with my family and eat pizza or like we're barbecuing, I will probably have salmon. Um, my dad will get salmon for me. And I will eat their food a little bit, but just to know that I have my own food and I don't have to eat out every day. Um, it's how I, I don't know, it's just how I, I love just caring for my body and um, this is how I do it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thumbs up, please subscribe, and hope you guys have an amazing day and holidays. Yeah, mm, bye.